Okay, so you're all hearing how to take the cards, okay? Mm -hmm. And I will tell you if you can cut the cards into parts. Yes. Like here. So like this? Yes, and I will hear the cards. Okay, so now you will take one of the cards, the card that you have selected. Can you take it? Yeah. Okay, and show it to the camera, but I don't want to see it. Okay. Okay, okay I will try to draw your card, okay? Can you please? Mm -hmm. Like this? Yes. Okay. I will try to draw it here, okay? Yes? Yes. This is your call. Bad at the back. Ah. I haven't seen that. <laughs> That's easy, I can do that as yeah. well. <laughs> so now look at this movie. She needs to draw again and we'll so So now at first time, which is your call? Uh, it's the King of Clubs. King of Clubs, yeah. This is also this is also the King of Clubs. You want really? to see it? Yes, of course. The kids clubs. Yes. It's yours. And you can select. Yes. Very nice. Thank you. Hi guys, my name is João Miranda. I'm Julio Montoro. And welcome to Sketch. Sketch is this amazing piece that allows you to create a visual transformation from a drawing to a real playing card. First of all, it really is extremely easy to perform and it comes with every single gimmick that you have received. Uh, as Julio and I will explain you in a few moments, you will see that the trick really is extremely easy. You just need to squeeze the pad and the magic happens by itself. So that's all, and let's start with a sketch. You will have, first of all, this card, okay, which is a flap card, okay, made with elastics, okay, which also has a magnet here, okay. You will also receive a notepad, okay, with a big magnet here at the back of the last page, okay? The cool thing is that this page is bigger than the other one, so you just need to sketch. Squeeze. Squeeze, yes. okay, okay. Mm -hmm. So the cool thing is that you have a bigger magnet here, a big... So the cool thing of this page is that you have a big magnet here, and it is bigger than the other ones, so you just need to squeeze like this, as you can see, and air will come here inside, okay? So the magnets from the pad. Yes, they will stop making contact. Exactly. Yes. Yeah. The cool thing is of this notepad is that it is made with whiteboard, okay? So you can draw on it yes. and then you can erase it with your fingers, but I recommend you to use a uh, paper, okay? Mm -hmm. Just because of, it will be cleaner, okay? Yes, it's important that you use a whiteboard marker. Do not use a Sharpie or a permanent marker, mm -hmm. all will ruin the, the notepad. Yeah, also the flap card is made with the same paper, okay, than the notepad. So, which means, which means that you can draw here like this, okay? Yes. So people will be able to see that you are drawing here. Then you can sign right here. Just making this, the card will appear. Okay. Mm -hmm. I recommend you that not to take the card, not to catch the card. Just leave your hand here yes, and make it appear. It's more magical. Yeah, it's more magical, and also it is easier because if you need to catch to catch the card, you can maybe do the card can fall to uh, can fall to the floor. Like that. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes, it's very nice. So after you, um, it really enhances the illusion, the, the fact that you draw yeah. on the on the card itself. Yes, it's it's really good. Yes. What you can do uh, of the routine is this: you can have this, okay, without any uh, ink, and you can see to the spectator that you will draw um, a card, okay, a prediction card. So you have it here. You close the notepad and you put it inside your back pocket or on the table. So now the spectator select one car, for example, the King of Clubs, okay? And then you say, okay, do you remember my car? The car that I draw here, it is your car, but at the back. I will finish the draw, almost like this, okay, and I will sign it. 
right here. Now look at this. What was your car? My car was the king of clubs. The king of clubs really. You only need to make this. The car will appear and you will show that it is the king of clubs. Mm -hmm. But what about if the spectator wants to see the cut? It is very easy. Mm -hmm. You just need to have another king of clubs. So you will put the king of clubs here like this, okay? The back of the car will touch the magnet. So now what you will do is this. You will put it here. You will activate the flap. You show the key, and now you need to change that car into that one. Okay? So what you only need to do is this. And you change it, okay? Just making this. It's very easy. Now so people are reacting to the trick. Yeah. So since you do it in off beat, no one will see the change. It's impossible. So let's see it again. You just need to make it appear, show it to the camera, and then change it and you can give it to the spectator if you want. Yes. Normally people don't want to examine. Yeah. Yes. By our experience they don't want to grab the car or examine the notepad. But in any case, if you really want to change the car, which I don't think it's important, you can do it like all you just told you. Totally. Yes. So I think that's all. Uh, it is, this is a very easy trick to perform and the only thing that you need to know is how to force a car that mm -hmm. we will explain you now at the end of the video if you don't know how to force a car so uh, I think that's all you all yes that's it I really hope that you enjoy sketch thank you very much for getting bye 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 Okay, now just in case you don't know actually how to force a card, we are going to explain you probably the most easiest force in the world, so you can perform the trick. So, first of all, just grab a deck of cards and place, in my case, the card that has the flat is the king of clubs, okay? Just place the king of clubs on the top of the deck and you are ready to go. To start, start by showing to the audience that the cards are all different and ask the audience to place their hands like this like a, a small table. Then, we'll tell someone to grab a pile to this end. Can you please grab one? Yes. And then, this is the top card. What you are simply going to do is place this just like this. Okay? So, in fact, this is the top card. But then, what happens is that you are going to explain to the audience that uh, there are 52 cards, they are all different, the spectators could have cut the cards where they want to, so they totally forget where they cut the deck. They really forget that this is in fact the original top card of the deck. Then it's very easy to tell to the audience to show the card to everyone, and of course... What? Yes. The king of clubs. This will be the fourth card.